Director General of the World Health Organization, Dr. Tedros Ghebreyesus, was amongst dignitaries at the launch of the Afrigen Technology Transfer Hub in Cape Town. The facility was born after the peak of the COVID-19 pandemic, when countries were in a rush to get vaccines, and African countries were being left to fend for themselves. The hub will allow for the production of vaccines for other diseases. ENCA senior journalist Aviwe Mtila tells us more. Ribbons are being cut and the single most exciting public health project in the world is launched. The Director General of the World Health Organization is in the country to oversee the official launch of Afrigen's mRNA technology transfer and manufacturing hub, one of six around the world. The COVID-19 pandemic highlighted that one of our most important strategies for addressing global health emergencies is to increase the capacity of all regions to produce medical countermeasures such as vaccines and therapeutics. That's why WHO is supporting this multilateral effort on the mRNA technology transfer program. What is good with the technology is that it's, it's a technology which can, you know, with this experience, can be used also to produce, uh, to, to find and produce vaccines for other, you know, older diseases like uh, tuberculosis, like malaria, but also the scientists also indicate that they also have a potential to can also produce vaccines which will prevent some of the cancers. Africa imports 99% of its vaccines while importing 92% of all its medicines. This hub will give the continent better access to medication, especially when the rest of the world opts to hog it in times of need, says the higher education minister. You, you cannot reserve a part of a swimming pool when we are all in the swimming pool for those who want to pee and, and, and hope that the swimming pool, all of you, the rest of you won't actually be affected by that. So that is the significance. I'm sorry about that example if it's inappropriate, but to me it best describes what we are actually trying to do. No part of the world must be left behind in relation to any of the pandemics that we have now and the future as we go into it. We are unfortunately entered the age of pandemics. High-level researchers and developers from around the world were part of the delegates in attendance. Ah, Viwem Tila, Cape Town.